Transduction is the process of transferring the energy that we have from, uh, from in this case, sound waves into uh, electrochemical waves that the brain can understand. So with sound waves, we've, we've got the, 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 the waves coming in through the, the pinna. The pinna is the outer ear that, that everyone has. President Obama has very large uh, pinnas on, on his head. Um, uh, the information, the, the, the waves of the sound go down the ear canal. Uh, then they hit the eardrum, sometimes known as the tympanic membrane. The vibrations go to the bones of the inner ear, the hammer, anvil, and stirrup, or the incus malleus and stapes. Information then goes to the oval window where that vibrates, and that vibrates the fluid that is in the cochlea, which vibrates the basilar membrane, which contains what is known as the cilia, or hair cells. These hair cells are the ones that uh, stiffen and break off when you uh, are doing some of the damage to your ears by listening to your, um, your iPods or earbuds uh, way too loud. That information is where the transduction occurs, uh, and then we get into the nerve fibers where we now have electrochemical energy, it goes all the way down here to the auditory nerve, sends information to the thalamus, then redirected back out to the auditory cortex of the temporal lobe so that the brain can then deal with that information.